Hello Aquarius and welcome to your coffee cup reading for the week ahead of November 12th through the 18th. Hmm. Yeah, well, some of you are like trying to make a financial decision. This could be even juggling something. This is something about a second source of income for some of you, okay? There's a focus on money and maybe a decision or choice. There is an end to a situation, okay? Um, I do see that. End to a cycle. There is a lot of stress here, too. So I see a lot of stress. Maybe you're just very worried, you know, things in, in your head. I don't know. There is a situation and a, or people may be leaving your life this week. Okay, then you have, um, like I said, fresh starts starting all over again. Yeah, and a very new beginning. Now, it's a lot of kind of sharp energy, so be careful of stress. Be careful of, um, you know, sometimes this is where we stress a lot and we have um, a lot of mental burnout, um, too much, you know, going on. You need maybe to... De uh, recharge for some of you when you see a lot of that energy I don't know if it's your health or dealing with surgery something like that because I'm seeing that energy as well I do see that unexpected news can come through this could be you know expected unexpected this could be a phone call a message um and it connects to you it connects to someone from the past or someone that you have been thought of in years I don't know something like that is happening expect the unexpected I do see um, surprises coming through. These could be strange discoveries in strange places, things like that. I'm just seeing a lot of these unexpected type of energy. Um, matters of the heart. Some of you could be very lucky. There's good energy there too. Lucky in love. I do see maybe you're more to yourself, okay? Um, a lot of thoughts for the future. Make sure things are realistic though. I do see there is um, some things that maybe you do not know about. Okay, so there is hidden elements here too. Uh, be careful of making any foolish decisions. That's one thing I'm seeing. Haste is waste. Yeah, and there's going to be a decision that you're going to have to make as well. So I'm seeing that with some of you. We're separating from something. Um, yeah, there is a little bit of energy. You may feel let down, like uh, something doesn't go your way. But I do see a lot of emotional energy too. Okay, so... Your emotions need to be controlled this week. Don't let your like emotions dictate your um, decisions or anything like that, okay? So that's one thing. They need to be controlled. You need to really organize your feelings. Um, and definitely, you need to get plenty of sleep and rest, okay? Rest that mind, <laughs> if anything. You need to recharge and energize yourself because we got some very powerful like energies coming through here, too. Okay, it's like, you know, there could be a power struggle where, you know, some of you could just be dealing with a lot of stuff. So that's another thing I'm seeing as well. And there's an end to a situation. Watch out for conflicts and that too. You know, pick and choose your battles. It's like there are some things that you just need to just let go. It's like beating a dead horse. Okay, so that's one thing I'm seeing here as well for um, some of you. Like I said, it's a general reading on your plate. Yeah, I see here that maybe there is something that you may hear that you do not like. Um, it's very advisable to just release anything. There's an energy here you need to, like, let go, okay? You need to let go of something you've been kind of obs obsessed about or, hold or holding on, whether it's a resentment, a grudge, whatever. Let it go. Um, that's really coming through here, okay? You do have a yes answer to anything I don't answer. Yes is, like, whatever it's going to, you know what I mean. But I do see a turn of events happening. Okay, and you need to rebalance yourself is what I'm seeing here too. Okay, be logical, be uh, more logical, not emotional, and uh, really think of consequences or anything, um, you know, because to every cause is a consequence. So rebalancing yourself is very important and letting go of something. That's one thing I'm seeing here very strongly. Okay, Aquarius, that was your reading for the week ahead of November 12th through the 18th. I hope you have a wonderful week, and I'll catch you back next week for your next Coffee Cup reading. Until then, all the best.
and I was going to say bye for now, but this is definitely reconfirming it. You do need to let go of something, and as it is, it's moving as you're seeing here. Once you do let go of something, you're coming into a new beginning, okay? New emotional path and into beautiful energy. So letting go of something, just letting go, and it could be something connected to the past. Here it's formed a cross again, so that's um, the end of a cycle, death and rebirth, you know, transformation. Let it go, okay? Yes, everything can be emotional. Maybe, you, I don't know, whatever, whatever it is, whatever you're going through, it's just telling you to let it go. And look, it moved right in front of your face, guys. So, and that's going to form a new path. It's like a relief, you know, trust, trust it, you know? It's like, why carry some kind of anger, hate, uh, pain, or whatever it is, just let it go. The world is not fair, let's put it that way, if that's it. Once we let it go, it comes to something beautiful, starts a new emotional cycle. So that's a message that really came out through, and it, it, it was actually transforming right in front of your eyes. So anyway, Aquarius, again, I hope you have a wonderful week. Catch you back next week for your next Coffee Cup reading. Until then, all the best, and bye for now.